Performing a vertical mulching with compost on the silver maple tree experiencing some tip dieback in the crown. This is done to target the tree's roots and to minimize leaching the nutrients to the grass. First, determining hole placement. We spray painted a radial pattern away from the trunk of the tree with holes approximately 3 to 5 feet apart up to the drip line of the tree's crown. Next, we prepared our towable air compressor, set it to 90 psi, and began air spading. Each hole was excavated approximately 8 to 18 inches deep. An air excavation device like the air spade is preferred over a shovel because it significantly reduces the chance of damaging the tree's root system. If we encountered a root, we just moved a few inches to the side. Another key benefit to vertical mulching is that the air spade will also help decompact the soil, which will improve water movement and gas exchange in the soil. Afterwards, we backfilled the holes with compost and covered the top 1-3 to three inches with topsoil. You may reseed grass if you'd like. It is important to lightly tamp the soil down to not leave large air pockets that may dry out the roots and to water the root system once you're finished. Recapping, the key benefit of vertical mulching is to generate healthier soil structure and, in turn, promote tree root growth.